Carlos, what positives are you taking from Reading from the defeat? Mm, a lot of things, uh, positive things. Uh, our defensive organization was very, very good again. The, the, the goal is just the second come from a mistake, but a mistake that can happen when two players try to win one ball and the ball pocket. These kind of things can happen. It's not a, a qualitative mistake or, or something that's a sector mistake also. It's something that can happen. Uh, we wish that don't happen, but sometimes these kind of things happen. Um, and uh, but the defensive organization uh, was was very good. Uh, we block completely the reading the way that they play completely. Uh, Westy did a easy easy game. It was a easy game to him. Um, in the offensive organization, I think uh, we create some chances. With not easy, uh, but we create some chances. Three or four against reading uh, um, that we can achieve a goal, but we didn't achieve. Um, set pieces, I think we did well, no problems, we are improving and we are doing. Um, in the transitions also we did well, so uh, we didn't do too many different in this game that we did in different in the previous games. The big, the massive difference was that they achieved the goal first than us and uh, we must uh, score uh, one goal first than them and we have sh more chances than them. And also, when we react, uh, okay, the goalkeeper did a fantastic season because we almost uh, in the minimum draw. But I must tell you that in that game, if we draw, I will I will be not happy with the score uh, because um, I think we <coughs> we, the, we was the best pitch or, or the best. Not I can say this, we was the threat, the more threat team on the on the pitch because I must respect, of course, the reading and the work of the of the team. But I think it was more threat in that game. Lucas Shaw's had plenty of chances over the last few weeks and not hit the back of the net. Are you needing to like put your arm around him and try and get him through this period and get him get him that goal? Yeah, well, is what 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 we must do is doing the qualitative work, uh, like for example, knew you did the uh, qualitative work very well. He blocked the opponents, and um, when we win the ball, we, of course, he tried to move and try to open spaces and try to score. And uh, when the players did uh, the teamwork, uh, and they are try to do and they do the they, they fight at last second and uh, and fight a lot to the team. I don't have one single word uh, against. It's the opposite. I must be proud of my players. After, if they miss one goal, if they did a mistake, okay, this is part of football. But what I want that they give, they must give, they must give one hundred percent of the on the pitch. And my players did this, and they are is why I think they deserve that uh, our fans uh, push to them because they are doing. And you see the when we finish the game, and you look, and you have almost eleven players down on the pitch, almost crying. This means that we are with the heart, and we are here to. <coughs> To, and we are feeling, we are feeling the the club, and we are feeling what what we are doing, and this is a good sign to the to the future. What have you thought about Sam Hutchinson's performances since he's been moved into midfield? What have you made to his? I play well in all the positions. If you put him right back, maybe a goalkeeper will not do perform well, but if you put him right full back, centre half, midfield, he will perform uh, well all the time. It's a team that. Is one kind of one of the symbols that what I want in the in the <coughs> that he give everything on the pitch, never give up, go at the limits, uh, fight in all the situations of the game and give the maximum is what I want for Sheffield Wednesday. So he's one of the players that that uh, <coughs> that is like a symbol, one of the symbols that I I want to the Sheffield Wednesday. George Hurst got a bit of a run out as well. Is that something that we're likely to see more of? Yes. He did well. He did uh, try to to move. Uh, I think uh, it was more easy to him if he was winning, if he scored and he was winning because he's a player with a big pace, and uh, the game will be more uh, more to the characteristics that he have, the, the best of characteristics that he have. But he, he go inside with the, in the difficult time and uh, he, he tried to do the best, and uh, we are happy with uh, what he did. And what are you expecting from Basel tomorrow? What sort of game? No, I told before it's a team very tough. It's a, one of the best teams in the competition uh, with a away performance so far, and uh, we expect the difficulties. Of course, we know that uh, they are a tough team to play against. Uh, we are we saw them uh, how they play, and uh, we try we'll try to block the 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 positives that they have. They have some weak points, and we try to explore the maximum of the weak points that they have to achieve goals.